Hi, thanks for joining me on the YouTube channel for Discover Your Life Today. My name is Maveen Cora. I'm from discoveryourlifetoday.com. Today I'm going to be going over something interesting, my haircut. Uh, hopefully you guys like my haircut. I just got it cut right now. I actually went to a local barbershop called Tommy Gunn's Original Barbershop in Calgary. I actually did a quick write-up on this as well on my website. It's called discoveryourlifetoday.com forward slash Tommy Gunn's Barbershop. Um, so take a look at that article as well. What I want to do is go over five reasons I went and checked out this um, haircut salon and kind of five things that I noticed that were very really unique to them versus some other barbershops around as well. Uh, so, you know, one of the reasons was, you know, <clears throat> it's a kind of a barbershop for men instead of a, a unisex for men and women. Uh, so that was one thing that was really different, I noticed. It's a place that you can go and definitely get the royal treatment. Uh, as soon as I went in there, you can kind of see I've gone in and really have got cleaned up. I wish I had a picture of me, uh, of what I looked like before. But you're more than welcome to take a look at some of the other videos. I know I've had other videos where I have longer hair and whatnot. So you can really get a good feel for kind of uh, the look that I, I've gone for. What happened was, uh, originally the first time when I went here was I actually had gotten a coupon in the mail and to take a look at them, they were offering a free haircut and I said, you know what, why not take a look at them and see what they can do. Uh, obviously they've done a great job. Uh, so you know, the last time I really had an opportunity to go to a barber shop was when I was a little younger. I was probably about three, four years old. I got my hair cut for the first time and that was at a real uh, barber shop or salon. Uh, so going to Tommy Guns was really interesting because it kind of gave me that same type of experience that I only remember from pictures that my parents had taken uh, back when I was younger. Uh, nice thing is here is, you know, I had an opportunity to get about a $30 haircut as well as a nice close shave uh, as well as you can see. Uh, so nice thing is, you know, uh, I got to experience kind of what they do uh, there. So five things that um, I noticed when I went to Tommy Gunn's original barbershop. So I just want to kind of go over those with you. Uh, you know, one is the atmosphere. The atmosphere is very neat. Uh, from the moment I walked into the shop, you know, it was very different. They have the warmer colors, the reds and the browns, the brown as the bricks. It really gives it that nice uh, feel in that shop. A very 30-esque um, uh, kind of uh, salon as well. A nice bright colors to kind of invite you into their uh, into their workplace. And one thing I noticed was when as soon as I I walked in there's a tablet in the front for me to sign in uh, as soon as I sign in my name pops up on the television where it tells me how uh, says my name how long it will be and the type of service I believe that I was getting uh, you know there's also other tablets there as well so if I want to sit and you know play some games while I'm on the waiting list or if I want to you know jump in and um, you know take a look at other stuff like on Google or whatnot I can absolutely do that uh, you know there's a front huge uh, TV at the front desk that typically has like a sports game on or whatnot so that was kind of neat as well uh, you know kind of a it's a real cool place as a man cave right because that's kind of the idea behind it uh, and really got that feeling as soon as I walked in to get my hair cut um, I could also see that uh, you know one thing that was different they offered me a pop you know, a coffee or even some water uh, if I wanted. You know, typically I go in, they'll offer to take my jacket and hang that up for me. But typically no pl other place I've been to actually offers me a nice beverage. Uh, this is a great sales tactic that they're using, absolutely. And it's a great way to uh, bring in the customer to your place because they feel at home when they do. Uh, another thing they had there was an arcade game, really cool. Uh, you know, when was the last time you can go get your hair cut and play an arcade game while you're waiting? So number two, the kind of a, a thing that made them a little bit different than any other barbershop is, uh, you know, they had televisions in their mirrors, which I thought was really cool. I know typically uh, the last time I had gone to a hotel room, they had, to, uh, you know, televisions in their mirror. They're kind of built in. Really neat uh, concept, uh, you know, so when you're getting your hair cut, you can put on the game, you know, watch the news or, you know, watch a cooking show, whatever you enjoy to watch. Uh, you know, for me, I'm not a big fan of having a TV while I'm getting my hair cut. I really enjoy, uh, you know, just having a conversation with the person caught kind my hair so you know I did ask them to turn off the TV but I did witness a lot of other people watching TV while they were getting their hair cut and they seemed to definitely enjoy the idea of having that uh, available to them. Number three, the haircut is actually very different too. So one of the things that the lady mentioned to me that was cutting my hair was, you know, it's not just about the haircut, it's about the detail that's in the haircut. So, you know, a lot of things that people may not see uh, that you have experienced. You know, a lot of people do not get to uh, see that you had a scalp massage or a shampoo or the conditioning uh, that was done to your hair. They don't get to see all the different tonics and products that they're using in your hair to have it look the way you want. Uh, you know, it's about the experience and not a lot of people will get to see 
see that. And so when I was getting my hair cut and, and uh, washed and whatnot, they really did show that and, and, and I really did get to experience that uh, details that not everybody else will potentially experience. So part of going in and getting a haircut, they also are uh, labeled themselves as the home of the original hot shave, which is kind of cool. So the hot shave and uh, skin treatment is kind of neat as well. So, you know, this is something that I can experience myself. I know I can go home and shave anytime I want, but having someone else get a really nice close shave in on you, uh, very different, right? So, uh, you know, our significant others go in to get their nails done hair, and uh, their hair done and their, and their, and their uh, toes and whatnot done. So, you know, this is a great salon for men to go in and uh, get some work done on their skin as well, right? Uh, so they do do a hot uh, shave, like I said. They use multiple hot towels, you know, the uh, shaving oils and face massages is what you get as well. You know, they use moisturizing cream, uh, you know, cold towel and, and uh, lotions as well after the shave is done as well to give it a nice cooling sensation. The person who cut, uh, did um, the shave for me as well kind of taught me a little bit about the products and why you know she was using those products on my skin. Told me about the different features and benefits and the advantages for me and my skin, which I thought was very cool and interesting because not everybody's going to tell you what the products are doing for your skin uh, in the short term and or long term. The fifth thing I really enjoyed about uh, going to Tommy Gunn's original uh, barber shop here was, you know, typically when I go to a hair cutting place, it takes about 15, 20 minutes. I feel like they brought me in, they put me down in my in the chair, they cut my hair and they send, send me on my way. I didn't feel like that here at all. I really did feel like I was getting kind of like a spa treatment. Uh, you know, I was in there getting my hair cut and a shave and for almost about 90 minutes, which is kind of cool. Not often do I go somewhere where I can, you know, kick back for 90 minutes and really just allow somebody to, uh, you know, work on my hair and work on my uh, face. So, facial hair as well. Uh, you know, after all my services were complete today, what I did have was an opportunity to go to the front with the person. They kind of showed me all the different products they, they had used on me on that were on the shelf as well, where they were on the shelf. It told me a little bit about, again, what those products were and what they would do for me. If you have an opportunity to go to a, an awesome hair salon like Tommy Guns, I would definitely suggest to go there. If you don't have a Tommy Guns in your uh, area, what I would suggest is go look for a local um, barbershop salon that actually is catered for men and just give them a try right because they're going to have hopefully some similar um, uh, services that they provide there again my name is Maveen Cora this is just kind of a review of, of getting a haircut and a shave from Tommy Guns and the establishment uh, you know like this YouTube channel if you've had an opportunity definitely uh, subscribe if you have not had the opportunity to you know if you've had your hair cut there please leave a comment below and let me know how that has gone out gone for you if you've been to other establishments maybe let me know some about other establishments that are good. I'm in the city of Calgary, Alberta, Canada. You know, if there's other cities that you are from that you're listening to this video from and watching this video from, let me know where you're from. And, you know, I'd love to take a, uh, you know, check out that establishment if I'm ever in your city. Uh, if you have any other comments or questions, please leave me a uh, comment, uh, comment and a question and I'll be happy to answer that. Other than that, hope you have yourself a wonderful day and don't forget to check out discoverylifetoday.com uh, and uh, for other articles.